Alright lads, welcome back to another video. Now, you may notice, you may not, I'm on a different camera. You'll certainly notice that I'm on a different camera when I do this, because it is indeed a GoPro. That should have made my face look very fisheye type lens, because I've currently got it on the setting for Super View, which is the kind of big fisheye lens type thing that the GoPro is well known for. I can also have it on this one, which kind of brings in the radius more of what you can see around me so that might make a difference but then the GoPro also has this option which allows you to have basically a normal camera type look which is a new addition to the GoPro Hero 8 which this one is so this should be more of like your regular type view that you see me in so I'm going to keep it on wide just now Super View is the highest one the first one that I showed you wide was the second one and linear was that third one that I showed you, so I'm going to have it on wide. Today we're off to St Andrews, I'm going to try the audio in an outside environment. I'm hoping it's a wee bit windy just so I can try it out in that sense, but obviously home it's still a nice enough day to walk about St Andrews and enjoy it. Are you ready to go out, dear? In two seconds. You look fantastic, I must say. Thanks. You should see me um, in the clips before as well. <laughs> go into the bins. Doing the domesticated stuff before enjoying our day. Oh, oh Jesus. Well done, dear. Oh, <laughs> oh here we go. Open sesame. Right, you are set up better than what you used to be because you used to be set up on this wee camera mount thing that's on the side here. I can't even move you for this spot unless I take you off the mount that you're on now, but GoPro comes with a like really stick adhesive type mount thing that you put on the dashboard of your car. So you're very well stuck on now. So one, there shouldn't be any shake, hopefully, fingers crossed. And two, you should be able to just see basically everything in the car. You should be able to see Jenny. You should be able to see me and the wheel. So, we're well set. Let's go to St Andrews. Ah, here we go. Jesus. Police at the opposite crossing. Brilliant. No pressure then. Police just across the road. On you go, bro. On you go, on you go. Parked up, ladies and gentlemen. It's about an hour and a half after you saw the last clip of us. That was when we were in Telecutri, our dear home, and now we're parked up somewhere in the middle of St Andrews. Literally had to go right outside the town centre to find free parking. But aye, it's been quite a good drive, good experience. Never really driven to any of these places before, so all different types of roads, quite a lot of kind of country road type vibes driving up here and sometimes it just wasn't that great but we made it so we're now going to go into st andrews and i'll try out this gopro see what the audio is like etc the sun is shining scotland this is what you're talking about there she is sunny's on and everything At this point I'm literally just trying things out, like, might be of no relevance to you these clips, but literally just trying things out. Also try to see if the audio, which is coming through this front mic here, that's where the main audio is coming through, so hopefully you're able to pick me up, it's quite busy here and you can hear a lot of different things in the background. And right lads, you know what, this should be the ultimate test of the audio, because I'm right next to this thing that is making a hell of a lot of noise, so if you can hear me now, then the GoPro will work at any football location. It's a massive beach like the Titan one obviously but by Crikey there's a lot of space around there. Right we're going to try a week in a conversation type clip now because I've never really had that yet. 
heard myself talking, I'm quite loud spoken, Jenny's quite softly spoken, we're near a bit of wind and that, so what's your thoughts, St Andrews? It's really nice. Come on, mere yeah. content. Uh, it is sunny, but it's not like midsummer sunny. Not kind of sunglasses house. vibes? Well, it is, because <laughs> I'm protecting my eyes. Heading up to the top of this rock. <laughs> I think it's fair to say that the drop from where we are right now, he'd try and jump over this onto the next rock. <laughs> You're not going to get that type of coverage for me, put that way. So where's here? The drop's there. And then you've got that in between. Hey. <laughs> well, thanks. <laughs> Well, I think it's fair to say the GoPro has done decent so far. I've not checked any of the clips, but I would assume it's done pretty well. Hopefully, audio is good. Should be good here. It's like perfect here. There's no wind at all. Aye. So, Orange is a nice place. GoPro seems to be working fine. Result and the Pope is in that window, <laughs> and the Queen is in that window. And back in the car, ready to go home. Catch you in Tilly. <laughs> and we're back in Tilly Kutri. The GoPro's been performing really well today. I'm really happy with the outcome that I've seen from it. Obviously, I've now looked back at the clips. I've edited the full video and this is now just getting added in at the end. I'm really happy with it. And the quality of it as well, like the quality of the footage. I'm not even shooting in 4K, which the GoPro can. I'm shooting in 1080p and the footage is still really like sharp and crisp. So I'm really looking forward to using this in a football sense because it's like really small. So you can get the best use out of it in that sense. And also just the fact that like the audio seems to be picking up really well overall and the colours on the GoPro seem to be picking up really well as well, so it should add a bit of brightness to whatever videos I go and make. So this, I think, will end up being my new vlogging camera. And aye, it's been a good investment. 350 quid for the full thing. The GoPro itself was 250 the GoPro Hero 8 Black. And then on top of that, I got a screen protector for the lens and for the back bit where you can see the view that you're filming because the new GoPro didn't offer changeable lenses when you break them so you have to get screen protectors so I got them they were £20 I got a dual battery charger which obviously I had to buy a spare battery for as well so I got two batteries and one dual charger that overall cost me I think about £60 so it all adds up in the end day eh? It is what it is. I really wanted this GoPro. I've been wanting to get one for ages and I feel like it's been a good investment with my money. I could afford to get it so ultimately I wanted to treat myself. <laughs> so I'm, I'm really happy with it. Looking forward to making content with it when the football returns. Very different style of content today lads. If you did enjoy it please give it a like. Comment down below your thoughts on the GoPro and how you think this will perform in a football sense. Subscribe for more football type content in the future and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers guys!